How would you and your family like to adopt an animal for the summer? At the end of the school year, the Needham Science Center closes down, so they're seeking homes for a variety of little critters that they keep for elementary education. This is a great opportunity for kids to learn science and caretaking, as well as for families to have a fun house guest this summer. We went to the Science Center to meet the animals still in need for homes. Take a look and decide if your family would be interested. homes for our animals. Now a few of them are exotics and will go to a zoo but the rest of them we would love them to go out to um, private homes. It's great for the home because they can see do I want this animal for a pet or any animal for a pet. It's great for our pets because they don't always get a lot of interaction here and of course it's great for us because we know our pets are taken care of. Generally, the mammals go first, so the, the soft, cuddly ones like our rabbit, our chinchilla, some doves, three doves, and some zebra finches. And then we do have some reptile lovers here in Needham, so our snakes went pretty quickly as well. But the ones who are still looking would be a pair of dagoos. These two happen to be brothers and they're a little bit exotic in that you don't always see them in your regular pet store. The reason we got them at the Science Center and the reason you might enjoy them at home is because they are very active during the day. They're very busy, they're intelligent, they're curious, they can get to learn your voice, um, so they might be a little bit friendlier with you. Um, we have some ideas for training them, so if anyone wants to try that out for a summer, they can absolutely do that. We have two leopard geckos. They each come in their own cage. We have two tarantulas, and we also have a couple of tanks full of freshwater fish. As for the geckos and the tarantulas, they are very easy care animals. Tarantulas especially can be left on their own and you can go travel for like four or five days, they'll be fine. Um, both those animals though, gecko and tarantula, do eat live crickets. So it would be your responsibility to go to the store every couple weeks and pick up some live crickets for your animals. You treat the animal as if it's your own, but we will start you off with a supply of food We'll give you written instructions and we even give you an emergency contact number during the summertime. The Needham Science Center provides curriculum for elementary students and volunteer opportunities for older students throughout the school year. Now they need your help. They're always looking for more volunteers and encourage you to contact them through email or phone call. Also visit their website to explore programs and opportunities. We've had students both in middle school and high school go on to careers with animals who um, credit their start here working with animals. Of course, they're still looking for homes for their animals. The animal adoption is on a first come first serve basis. If there's an animal here that you want but it has a home, we always keep backup lists because you never know over the summer what might, may happen. For the Needham Channel News, I'm Jillian Tedesca.